I don't like to think too far ahead. People set like goals, long distance goals and shit. That's too much for me. I already feel like I'm living it. And then I just carry on doing that, you know, carry on day by day, already living the final goal, the goal of being the world champion. I already carry myself like I'm a world champion. I already speak like I'm a world champion. And, and that's it, I just carry on day by day. So I'll take it as it comes. A lot of Again, like I said, you were asking, asking me about the future. I'll let, you, I'll let you know a little bit closer, you know what I mean? As far, all I can see right now is the goal. That's all I can see. And that's it, I'm just curious. Curiously fascinated with it. And I can't stop thinking about it. Everything I do in my life is, is related to this. I don't do nothing else if it's not got to do with fighting. You know what I mean? And that, that, that is why, you know what I mean? To, to be true, is that that's nearly, all, all you've got to do is show up. Is that not unhealthy? Um, I don't know. Do I look unhealthy? Take a look at this physique. I'm in phenomenal shape in body and mind. To me, what's unhealthy is living an unhealthy life. To me, what's unhealthy is getting up and going through the same day, every day of your life, nine to five, in an office or in a, you know, that, that's unhealthy. That beats your mind. I don't, I don't work. I love what I do. And that's why I'm doing what I love. You know what I mean? That's why, that's why it's become a career for me because I love it. I love what I do. So I don't think it's unhealthy. I feel good in my mind. You know what I mean, it's, it's, my, it's my life. You stare at your past and you'll end up staying there. It's okay to look back and admire it, but you carry on. I'm not in the business of staring, staring back at it. You know what I mean? I'm getting lost back there. It's, people say a loss can make or break a fighter, but trust me, a win can also make or break a fighter because they get comfortable with a, with a win. People can get comfortable with a, with a win and, and slack off then. Slack off on the training, slack off on the diet. They've won one. They're winners now. That's not me, you know. You sleep on a, you sleep on a win and you'll wake up with a loss. So I just carry on. Keep doing what I'm doing. And that's why this turnaround is so good for me. Vegas, straight away. The fighting Irish head to the fighting capital. It's, it's perfect. Continue on this path. The freight train, straight to the top. I mean, if you can see it here, and you have the courage enough to speak it, it will happen. So, I see these shots. I see these sequences. And I don't shy away from them. A lot of times people believe in certain things, but they keep to themselves. They don't put it out there. You truly believe in it. If you become vocal with it, you are creating that law of attraction and it will <clears throat> become reality. I'm enjoying the fruits of my hard work. Nobody works harder than me inside the octagon, outside the octagon. I am a workhorse, so I am gonna enjoy the benefits of this life. I am gonna get myself a big mansion in Las Vegas. I am gonna get the soft top cars. I'm gonna bring my whole team out. I'm gonna spoil them and give them this life. Big steaks that size, we're eating every single night each. We're eating good, we're living good. It's, it's human nature. Some people will sit and take positivity from that. They will look at that and, and take inspiration and inspire. It will inspire them to go and push for that. Others will shell up and critique it and, and, and be negative towards it. But one thing is for sure, those people will stay where they are. The people who take inspiration from it will rise up and, and also one day experience that life. So this is, this is human nature. Some go one way, some go the other way. But I am, I am enjoying my money, my hard-earned money that I, that I have dedicated my life to. Well, Gratitude so. is one of the most strongest forms of, of, of power in attracting good things. You know, if you truly feel grateful for the things in your life, I always felt grateful for even the small things. I always used to celebrate the small things. Now I might be celebrating the bigger things, but I always celebrate every little good thing that would happen to me in my life, even before I had any kind of money or any of that. I would celebrate and I would feel grateful for it and it just gave me more and this is exactly the same thing that's happening right now. I still remain grateful and more comes.